All right, so we just put the exterior walls in. I'm going to come here and go to shaded. You can see the ephus is on the outside. The jip is on the inside. It should be hanging over a little bit on the inside and a little bit on the outside as well. Um, if we take a look at our section one, right, we should see that the exterior, which is this, is actually lined up with the OSB plywood. And so that worked out fine. So I go back to my 3D view and let's close that section out. So the next thing I want to do is put the top parapet on. And here's something that you always have to take into consideration. This has drywall on it, this interior piece, but the rest of this is not. The parapet's going to go up. And there are some other pieces of parapet that go up, but let's just consider that the exterior piece is a parapet right now. It's not going to have, you know, drywall on the inside of it. So what we really need to do is make a new wall type. So I'm going to go to wall, wall architectural. It's going to give me the, zip, the sips with jip. And I'm going to go to edit type and I'm going to duplicate that and I'm just going to do a SIPS wall. Right? Click OK, edit the structure, and I'm going to get rid of the JIP, which is down here at the bottom, and just delete that layer. And click OK. And click OK. Now I just want to sort of make a rectangle around here that puts a parapet up here. So I'm going to go into my pick line command and instead of core face exterior, I'm going to just do finish face exterior. And I'm going to pick this wall. Well, first let's do this. Let's set the base to bottom of parapet and set the top to top of parapet. Then I can come in and pick this guy. And it'll plop that on top. I'll pick this guy. It'll plop that on top. Sort of spin around. Pick this guy. It'll plop that on top. And then pick that guy and I'll plop that on top. Then I can TR shortcut for trim. Trim that and that. Trim that and that. Turn around so it's... And then trim that and that. And I've got my parapet running around the top. Now you can go ahead if this is offensive right here, this line, you can use the join command under the modify and join these guys together. So join that and that. Join that and that. Join that and that, and it'll get rid of that line. So now I have a parapet wall on top of the jipboard wall. Now you could, you know, do this in a different way where, you know, you split the walls and had some of them go high, but, um, and that's up to you, you know, however you want to work joining the walls together. So there's the parapet wall. All right, so, um, Next time we come back, um, maybe we'll put the roof on. All right.